Welcome to my channel RX Sam 2020. Today we discuss a drug named tranexamic acid TXA. About tranexamic acid works by slowing the breakdown of blood clots, which helps to prevent prolonged bleeding. It belongs to a class of drugs known as antifibrinolytics. Tranexamic acid is not a hormone. It does not treat other menstrual or premenstrual symptoms. It does not stop your period. It is not a form of birth control and does not protect against sexually transmitted diseases. Medical Use Tranexamic acid is frequently used following major trauma. To prevent and treat blood loss in a variety of situations, such as dental procedures, heavy menstrual bleeding, nose bleeding, and surgeries with a high risk of blood loss. It is sometimes used, often in conjunction with oxytocin, to reduce bleeding after childbirth. Other Uses Tentative evidence supports the use of tranexamic acid in hemoptysis, in hereditary angioedema, in melasma, tranexamic acid is sometimes used in skin whitening as a topical agent injected into a lesion or taken by mouth, both alone and as an adjunct to laser therapy. As of 2017, its safety seemed reasonable but its efficacy for this purpose was uncertain because there had been no large-scale randomized controlled studies nor long-term follow-up studies. It is allowed as a quasi-drug, Cosmeceuticals Cosmetics, for skin whitening in Japan. In hyphema, tranexamic acid has been shown to be effective in reducing the risk of secondary hemorrhage outcomes in people with traumatic hyphema. Experimental Uses Tranexamic acid might alleviate neuroinflammation in some experimental settings. Tranexamic acid can be used in case of postpartum hemorrhage. It can decrease the risk of death due to bleeding by one-third according to the WHO, the World Health Organization. What is? Major trauma is any injury that has the potential to cause prolonged disability or death. There are many causes of major trauma, blunt and penetrating, including falls, motor vehicle collisions, stabbing, and gunshot wounds. Hemoptysis is the coughing up of blood or blood-stained mucus from the bronchi, larynx, trachea, or lungs. In other words, it is airway bleeding. This can occur with lung cancer, infections such as tuberculosis, bronchitis, pneumonia, and certain cardiovascular conditions. Hereditary angioedema, HAE, is a disorder that results in recurrent attacks of severe swelling. The swelling most commonly affects the arms, legs, face, intestinal tract, and airway. If the intestinal tract is affected, abdominal pain and vomiting may occur. Swelling of the airway can result in obstruction and trouble breathing. Without preventive treatment, Attacks typically occur every two weeks and last for a few days. Melasma, also known as Closma facy, or the mask of pregnancy when present in pregnant women, is a tan or dark skin discoloration. Melasma is thought to be caused by sun exposure, genetic predisposition, hormone changes and skin irritation. Although it can affect anyone, it is particularly common in women, especially pregnant women and those who are taking oral or patch contraceptives or hormone replacement therapy medications. Hyphema is a condition that occurs when blood enters the front, anterior, chamber of the eye between the iris and the cornea. People usually first notice a loss of vision or a decrease in vision. The eye may also appear to have a reddish tinge, 
or it may appear as a small pool of blood at the bottom of the iris or in the cornea. A traumatic hyphema is caused by a hit to the eye from a projected object or a blow to the eye. A hyphema can also occur spontaneously. Dosage It is taken either orally or by injection into a vein. Note for all medical use, renal impairment patients, mild to moderate, serum creatinine level, micromole L120 to 249 micromole L, 10 mg per kilogram 12 hourly, 250 to 500 micromole L, 10 mg per kilogram 24 hourly. Severe contraindicated. Oral. Hemorrhage. Adult, as short-term management of localized cases, 1000 to 1500 mg or 15 to 25 mg kg, 2 to 3 times daily. Oral, menorrhagia, abnormally heavy or prolonged bleeding, adult, 1000 mg TID, 3 times a day, during menstruation as necessary for up to 4 days, may be increased for heavy bleeding. Maximum, 4000 mg daily. Alternatively, 1300 mg TID during menstruation for up to 5 days. Hereditary angioedema. Adult, 1000 to 1500 mg 2 to 3 times daily given intermittently or continuously, depending on the patient's condition. Oral, patients with hemophilia undergoing dental extraction. Adult, 1000 to 1500 mg or 25 mg per kilogram, 8 hourly. Intravenous, incompatibility, incompatible with benzyl penicillin and blood for transfusion. Hemorrhage, adult, local fibrinolysis, 500 to 1000 mg 2 to 3 times daily. General fibrinolysis, 1000 mg or 15 mg per kilogram, 6 to 8 hourly. Doses are administered via slow injection at a rate of no more than 100 mg per minute. Intravenous Patients with hemophilia undergoing dental extraction Adult, 10 mg per kilogram as a single dose via slow injection at a rate no more than 100 mg per minute immediately before tooth extraction, followed by 10 mg per kilogram 3 to 4 times daily for 2 to 8 days. Administration May be taken with or without food. Contraindications Allergic to tranexamic acid History of seizures History of venous or arterial thromboembolism or active thromboembolic disease Severe kidney impairment due to accumulation of the medication, dose adjustment is required in mild or moderate kidney impairment. Color vision disorders. Subarachnoid bleeding. Bleeding in the space that surrounds the brain. Special precautions. Tranexamic acid is categorized as pregnancy category B. No harm has been found in animal studies. Small amounts appear in breast milk if taken during lactation. If it is required for other reasons, breastfeeding may be continued. In liver impairment, dose change is not needed as only a small amount of the drug is metabolized through the liver. Mild to moderate renal impairment. Irregular menstrual bleeding. Examination of the eye regularly during long-term use. Discontinue if the disturbance in color vision occurs. Side effects. Side effects are rare. Hypotension. Diarrhea. Blurred vision. Thromboembolism and thrombosis. 
सीरियस साइड इफेक्ट्स आर रेयर शॉर्टनेस ऑफ ब्रेथ और अ शार्प पेन इन योर चेस्ट स्टार्ट कफिंग और कफिंग अप ब्लड ड्रग इंटरैक्शंस क्लॉटिंग फैक्टर कॉम्प्लेक्सेस हार्मोनल कॉन्ट्रासेप्शन ऑल्ट्रेंस रेटिनोक एसिड frequently asked questions can i use tranexamic acid for hemorrhoids also called piles tranexamic acid was an effective drug to stop recent hemorrhoid bleeding and prevent further recurrent bleeding brand names that are mostly prescribed by doctors listed are cyclocaprin femstrual poz espercil caprin hemoscan cycloef combinations tranexamic acid txa plus mefenamic acid tranexamic acid is an antifibrinolytic it works by preventing the breakdown of blood clots to control excessive bleeding during periods mefenamic acid is a nonsteroidal anti-inflammatory drug nsaid that blocks the production of certain chemical messengers prostaglandins that cause pain and inflammation redness and swelling tranexamic acid plus ethamsalate is used in the treatment of heavy menstrual bleeding tranexamic acid is an antifibrinolytic it works by preventing the breakdown of blood clots and controls excessive bleeding ethamsalate is a hemostatic it works by increasing the ability of platelets to stick together and form blood clots it also helps control bleeding from tiny blood vessels capillaries mechanism of action tranexamic acid is a synthetic derivative of lysine that exerts antifibrinolytic effects by blocking lysine binding sites on plasminogen molecules inhibiting the interaction of plasminogen with formed plasmin and fibrin Thanks for watching please subscribe and like this video